Welcome to another AV Properties house tour. Hello everyone and welcome to another AV Properties house tour. Today, let us explore together and experience the luxurious vibe that this property imbibes. Now, before we start with our house tour, please don't forget to click subscribe to AV Properties' official YouTube channel. You can also check us out on Facebook and on Instagram. It's at AV Properties underscore official for all of our fresh listings. My name is Apple Grace and let's start the house tour, guys. But before we enter the property, let's put a spotlight on how beautiful the facade is. So it has an eclectic design. It's a combination or there's touches of modern Asian and industrial. And it's finished with top-notch and expensive material. So guys, there's so much that you have to check out. So we'll not make this one longer. Follow me. Okay, making our way up to the elevated porch. Let's go. So this is the first thing that you will see upon entering the entryway. But let me take you first to your four-car covered carport. So this one is also tiled. And most or all of the tiles in this house, the facade, the innards of the house, it's all important. We will be checking out this way. So this first door, this is not the main entry to the entire house, but this is one thoughtful addition to this property. So this is what the sellers or the owners call the in-law suite. So if you have elderlies or you can't let go of our parents, then this is a great idea to still have them within our property, but giving them the privacy that they need and they deserve. So, look at how beautiful this one is. Double height ceiling, you have a gorgeous chandelier, a really nice living area. And as we go deeper into the in-law suite, you'll find two beds, a mini area for prepping and cooking. So you have your range hood, you have your cooktop, you have your sink, and of course, toilet and bath. So this one is enclosed with glass frames. You have your floating vanity, you have your water closet, and a bidet, and a really nice vanity mirror. Cool. Guys, how many houses have you visited that actually has this feature? Let me know in the comment section. This is a great idea for all of you who are still in the process of building and planning your houses. Now, let's proceed to the main, main house. Okay, so what greets us as we step up your grand foyer or your porch is the koi pond. And the koi pond is such a thoughtful addition to this house because this is the first thing that greets you, right? It's alive and according to Feng Sui, so a koi pond invites calmness, prosperity, and all those things. So if I'm, I'm missing something, let me know in the comment section. All right. So to my left is the main entry door going inside the house. But since this house has a lot of surprises, I'll take you to the first one. Let's go. And we are here. So, since this is a lounge, let me lounge for a little while. So, it's really nice that it has its own personal access without entering the main entry door, right? So, if you're entertaining uh, friends and guests and you're kind of worried about, you know, viruses, then you can have them enter by that access door into the lounge and your backyard with a lap pool. Okay, so let me go to the deeper part of this property. So here, this is a four feet deep um, lap pool and you have your water accent. So it really gives you that nature feel, right? Even when you're within your property. And guys, if you notice, what kind of vibe does it give you? It gives me Bali vibe, although I haven't visited the place yet. Okay. 
Okay, so after this gorgeous part of the house, let's move to the open bar and the first kitchen in this property. So we have three all in all. So this is an open kitchen. All the tiles that are used are all imported from Germany and other places. And everything from the <laughs> kitchen fixtures, appliances, they're all imported. And this one is Smeg. So if you take a look closer, this one is still unused. So you'll be the first one to use this one. So you have your stainless steel sink. You have your cabinetry. Everything is modular by Viro Casa. And I'll be leading you to this spot that will be your shower area. So you can take a shower before dipping into the pool. Nice, right? Love the sconce lighting. And of course, this gorgeous drop chandelier. Now guys, I'll be taking you to the other end of your gorgeous lap pool. So again, this house feels like a holiday, right? You don't need to go anywhere else to enjoy all the amenities and the features. So let's go and check out the main entry door and the features that it offers. Let's go. Wow, it feels like I just came back from a vacation. What do you guys think? And now, this is a great reception area, high ceiling, this beautiful chandelier again. So now, it's time to check out what's inside or what's behind this door. But, of course, let me just feature to you this beautiful pivot door. So this is actually made up of um, eight kinds of wood, namely Molave, Kamagong, Nara, teak wood, and a lot more. So, let's open it using a key pop. Wow! Look at this grand foyer. And guys, check out that intricately designed ceiling. So that is laser cut. And you'll see more of that on the second floor ceiling. They call it the moon roof. Beautiful, right? So check out this one. This house is fully furnished. Um, the property sits on a 450 square meter lot area with a total floor area of 800 square meters. So what's on the right side? Okay, as we open this one, you'll discover that you actually have an access going to your backyard, to your pool area, to the lounge, and a lanai. Nice, right? So let's close this one and let me show you what the powder room looks like. Let's go. Oh, it's like the vibe of having your personal villa or a villa, right? So when you're here, freshening up, just open this curtain and you'll get a great view of the pool, directly to the pool in the backyard. So there's a sitting area here that also doubles as a storage. You have your drawers for all your toiletry stuff there. You have an extra large counter and this sink that's really nicely put in. It goes well with a gold accent faucet. Okay, so let's see what your toilet looks like. Nice. Again, all imported tiles. So you have your Empolo um, water closet and a bidet that's also gold accented. Cool. So after your beautiful powder room, so this is unique because this is the first time we've seen something that looks like this. Okay, I'll be taking you and show you more of the living area. Let's go. Wow. Again, luxurious, elegant, the perfect combination of all the elements. So you see white walls, cream walls, wood elements, so it goes really well with each other. So it has that cozy but still luxurious feel. So again, this house is fully furnished except guys for three artworks. So I'll be pointing out the first one. This one will be taken out. So, but the piano stays. And then when you move on this side of, it's still a part of the foyer. What do you think? Or the living area? Yeah. 
Okay, so this door is actually hiding behind plain sight. This is an access to the service stairs that will be leading you to the mezzanine area where the home gym, the office, and the staff room is, and also the guest room. This luxurious home is a smart home as well, so you got everything that you need. This sofa stays, but the coffee table is going. Okay, so now guys, feast your eyes at how beautiful of your living area is. Look how high the ceiling are. And as you look up, you will see this cream-toned wall accent right below the ceiling, so that is travertine. Okay, so top-notch material. And moving into this side, this is the focal point of your living area. So you have this um, imported tiles that is a great cladding and a great combination with the wood element as well. Nice, right? Okay, now guys, I'll be showing you what your dining area looks like. So this area can fit a 10-seater dining table. I think also 12. So let me just burst your bubbles, guys. This one is not going to be staying here. So the owner is taking this one out. And then another treat for the kids and the kids at heart. Whenever you're dining with the entire family, just open this one and there you have it. A view of the pool and the backyard. So it's so it's a great way to enjoy your meals with your family, right? When you have that view. And then on this side, just have to flip this one open and there you have it. Your open bar and your extended kitchen. Really nice, right? Especially for entertaining your guests and your friends. Let me know, guys, in the comment section what you think of the parts that I've shown you, okay? And I'm sure you guys are gonna love this feature of the house. Look up. That's a beautiful, intricately custom-designed chandelier. So it reminds me of what kind of flower? Okay, let me know. Dahlia? I don't know. <laughs> so guys, also another feature that brightens up the house and adds to that visual interest is this vertical slat cladding that goes from this side to the ceiling up to the other side of the room. So now, let me lead you to your gorgeous show kitchen. So this is modular cabinetry. It's all Viro Casa. This gourmet kitchen is such a delight, especially for those of you guys who love to cook and prep meals for the family. So let me just show you. Um, all of the kitchen fixtures and appliances are all smeg. And if you can see that one already, the pastel colored smeg appliances, guys, this one or those things are staying in the house. <laughs> and you have your double door refrigerator, it's also smeg. And what we love about uh, these modular cabinetry is it has a piano finish, meaning like, it's easy to maintain. You can just easily wipe off the grease, the grimes, and the dirt. And they're so beautiful. It's glossy. And let me just take a moment to look at and appreciate this one. Wow. <laughs> and something that's also an eye candy in the kitchen is these glass black, um, glass tiles backsplash. Gata, diba? And then you have your stainless steel sink with a gold accented movable faucet head and then you have your smeg cooked up smeg range hood and underneath it is more drawers for your storage so it's soft close mechanism as well there it doesn't make any sound and then okay one of my favorite spot the coffee nuke okay so what stays amongst this two you guys have an idea okay the red one stays the smeg stays but according to the seller the Delonghi or Delonghi is a gift, so it has sentimental value. He'll be bringing this out once this house is purchased. And then, if you also don't want to eat by the 
you know, formal dining area and you want to be casual about breakfast, then your waterfall center island or counter island, which is granite, uh, all of it is um, granite countertops. So you can enjoy your breakfast here. So we have your bar stools right in front and more storage on my side. Nice, right? Look at this. Rose gold trimmings. Really nice. Alright, so let's check out the third kitchen. This is the auxiliary kitchen. Let's go. Wow, this is also a delightful space for our house staff, especially when they are prepping the food. So it looks good, smells good. And you have your double sink right here. And another Smeg appliances, your cooktop, your range hood. And the honeycomb backsplash is really nice. It goes well with the color palette that they, choo that they chose for this part of the room or the auxiliary kitchen. Now let's see what's in store for us. So you have another prep area here, more storage for your grocery and kitchen needs. And then this door houses your pantry or this is a pantry area but right now they're utilizing this one as a pantry slash storage and not to miss inside the auxiliary kitchen you also have a double door refrigerator all right so now guys i believe we're done so i'll be taking you to the second level or maybe the mezzanine what do you think i'll show you let's go Look at that modern staircase with open riser. Everything else is glued together. It's very beautiful. And you have that hotel feel upon entering, right? So now let's go and check out what's on the second floor. Okay, going up. By the way, guys, we're stepping on thick slabs of Molave wood. And this one also, the railings are all made of Molave. So now, I know that you guys are excited to find out more about this uh, floor. But let me take you to the mezzanine area where it houses a home gym, a guest room, a storage room, and our staff room. So let's go and access it through this service stairs. And we are on the mezzanine. So you see CCTV cameras all over. Now the first room that we will be checking would be the full toilet and bath. All right, so this will be accessed or accessed by the people who will be staying in the guest room. So that's the next room that I'll be showing. So you have everything that you could possibly need in your toilet and bath. And I love how they keep the doors uniform from the main entry door. So it's all seamless um, when it comes to design. So come on in guys and take a look at this gorgeous and spacious guest room. So there's two beds. I think this can fit like two, three, four people all in all. So let me just walk right in the middle and look how big this space is. And you have your air conditioning unit and right behind the entry door is your cabinet for your clothes and Hey, we're done with the guest room and the full bath. Now it's time to head to... Okay guys, so you will be thinking, what is, there, uh, what is this service staircase for? So there are multiple accesses going to the mezzanine. Um, this one, if you remember from the auxiliary kitchen, as you exit the door, there's a staircase. So this is, this is it. Now let's go and check out the staff room. You're gonna be surprised and you're gonna love this one. Let's go. Okay, going up to where the staff room is. This is such a delightful, you know, feature of the house because 
this is again another first time for you guys to see so this part right here is actually originally envisioned to be a lounge area for our staff and our house help so excuse all of the dirt and <laughs> the chaos over there they will clean that up wow all right so again it has that hotel feel these are Salem beds you have your beautiful um, bed frames. And guys, yes, this is a staff room. And we really appreciate sellers and home builders who allocate and, you know, a lot a really nice space for their house helps. Because who are the people who work for us and work with us in the house, right? It's them. They help us out. And now let's see and check out how beautiful their toilet and bath is. So there's two shower areas one here one right behind you or right beside you and then they get to enjoy their lavatory they have a vanity wow this is just amazing so i hope some of our sellers and builders who are still in the process of building their houses or planning you can incorporate something like this and also if you can you can add an air conditioning unit so there it is guys so it's time for us to check out the two bedrooms, the home gym, and a little live streaming area by the mezzanine. Let's go! Alright, so guys, you've seen how spacious, cozy, and warm the staff room is. So that's actually a first of the houses that has that feature, but we hope it's not the last, right? So now let's go and check out the home gym and the storage room. Let's go. Wow, this is also nicely spaced. I can imagine you guys stocking your luggages, your winter clothes and stuff that you don't need at the moment. So what the sellers did is they, um, <laughs> they equipped this one with a bed. So if ever you have guests that's more than four or five, they can utilize this one as a bedroom or a guest room. But imagine this one as your storage area. Okay, let's close this one. And let me show you how beautiful the home gym is. Cool! As in malamig talaga. So it's equipped with an air conditioning unit. You have your full-size mirror so you can check yourself out while you're doing your workout and sweating. Okay, nice, right? And you have your cows masterpieces. I believe this one stays here, so if you're a big fan, then you're in for a treat. Now, let's check out this door. Where is it gonna lead us, guys? Okay, let's find out together. Nice! Okay, this is such a perfect room or spot for you guys if you are doing a lot of Zoom meetings, um, if you're also a live streamer, it's nice, or you just want to convert this one into a gaming room. So this is a perfect spot for you. So you have everything that you need. You have your mics, your television, or your monitor. What else do you need? Okay, so let's close this one and check out the second floor where the main bedrooms are. Let's go. Okay, so we're here again on the second floor. I hope you guys enjoyed the view of the home gym and the mini live streaming or gaming room. Now, look at how beautiful the second floor is. So let me just do a quick stop right here. So this is a laser cut, intricately designed um, accent that goes up to the ceiling to the end of the hall. So this is, again, a moon roof. So imagine a skylight but this one has a bit of a dramatic, more moody lighting effect. So this is perfect. It's not too bright, it's not too chaotic, it's soothing, it's calming. And to show you something more soothing is this incorporation of a mini indoor balcony, as I call it. So let me know in the comment section what you think. Look at this, you have a direct view of your custom-made drop chandelier that looks like starlight. So you can have your emo moment right here so let me just take that moment and appreciate how beautiful this mini balcony is so i have a view of the living area the foyer the staircase and this beautiful view nice right so after that one guys come on and show me or let me show you 
the family hall. So this is such a great addition for a landing area on this floor so you can get together with your family intimately if you have like friends or guests over staying at the ground floor. So you have this imported Italian tiles and look up and appreciate that beautiful ceiling and of course the custom-made chandelier. So yes, if you're thinking, oh, I'm a little stressed out, this is a perfect spot for you to recharge your emotional and social batteries, right? <laughs> now follow me as I do a stopover right here. So again, a down below look of what's happening on the ground level. And yes, another great view of the drop chandelier. So everything is custom made to the seller's liking. And I hope you guys appreciate the beauty that I'm seeing right now. And I know that you're eyeing this one for quite a little while. So this is, again, another artwork that will not be included in the sale of the house. But at least you get an idea of how you could, you know, style this wall right here. We are done with that beautiful scene. Now let's check out what this room will be showing us. So since there are kids in the house, so this um, room has been converted into a play area. So you have your shelves or what the kids call the cubby holes. So this is really nice. And while playing here, they also get to enjoy the view of the pool and the backyard. So it's something soothing for the children and we're big fans of it. So now guys, we're done with the playroom. Let me show you bedroom number one on this floor. You'll be surprised at how beautiful this one looks and it has that hotel vibe, everything. The interior design is impeccable. This is something that all of you guys are gonna love and appreciate look at this so the walls the tiles again are all imported so from this side to this you'll be able to appreciate this one even more when you see it up close and personal and then let's move into your walk-through closet or walk-in closet so you have a full-size mirror and then let's open the door that will lead us to your toilet and bath so there's actually a very unique feature inside this toilet and bath or all of the toilet and bath in this house. Look, here. This is no ordinary towel rack. This is a towel warmer. So yeah, it's warm. So this is actually perfect for countries that have like winters and cold seasons. But here in the Philippines, we can incorporate it, right? We have air conditioning units anyway. Nice. check out the second bedroom on this level. Wow, this view will never get old. And now on to bedroom number two. Wow, great. Wow, guys, we can sleep here. So it's really nice. Again, it has a hotel feel. And this wall is covered with wallpaper, but it actually has that veneer feel and finish. I know you guys, if you know how to appreciate, I mean, we all do. This is great, like a uh, feature of the house or the room. So you have your side tables on both ends of the frame and then air conditioning unit. Let me show you your closet and the toilet and bath. So I'm curious, does it look like the first one or no? Does it have a unique feature? Of course it does, another towel warmer. So the tiles used on bedroom number one is similar to what is being used here. You have your cabinet, a shelf, a really nice sink, and a floating vanity. Okay. 
Okay, done with bedroom two. Now let's check out bedroom three on this level. So if you're the owner of the house, you'll never get bored upon entering and exiting your bedrooms because everything is a sight to see. Wow, okay, I've spent a lot of wows in this house. All right, so I love how the bed frame or the design of the frame goes up to the ceiling. So it acts like a canopy, like something that protects you when you're asleep. And then imported tiles all over the house. You also have your side tables and you have a window right here and a balcony. Nice. And more on this side. Great. So now guys, we will be checking the toilet and bath. So you have your four door cabinet and a full size mirror as well. Okay, they look the same, but that's fine because kids nowadays, they get to be choosy and picky and they think that, you know, the parents favor one over the other, but with the <clears throat> interior of each room and toilet and bath, it all looks the same. So fair love for everyone. Okay, so we're done with bedroom three. Now, what's next? You know what, guys? I'm so excited to show you this one, the master bedroom. Now, before we enter, let's tap our key pop. Okay, so we have been denied twice, but let's see on a third try. Okay, I failed. Let's see again. Okay, guys, so give me more time to tap the key pop again. No luck? Okay, let's wait a little more. A few seconds. Yes, it's open. And you will be surprised with this one because it's actually a pivot door. And you know it, guys. This is the first master bedroom that features a pivot door and with a key pop to enter. So let's go. And again, you are greeted with a sitting area upon entering. And as you look up, you will adore this one. So it's a beautiful accent by the ceiling, right? It's like a halo hanging right above you. And now, welcome to the master bedroom. You have your air conditioning unit, this 85 inches smart TV also stays here. And guys, check out this beautiful wall cladding. So again, imported tiles are used for this one. You have your double access door for the master bedroom. And yes, the eye candy of the master bedroom, this gorgeous wallpapered um, wall. And then against your uh, bed frame, this is really nice. It's calming, it's soothing, and we love the color palette, right? It's very earthy. And guys, by the way, I almost missed this. So this is um, included amongst the three artworks that will be taken out upon purchase of this house. I know you like that, I do, but yeah, it's not staying here. So after the main bedroom now, let's check out the master toilet and bath and walk-in closet. Wow, this is such a delightful view. I mean, we all love to bathe and clean up and wash up, but this is such a treat for all of us, especially women who love beautiful things. I mean, we all do. So you have your display cabinet, so it's exposed. You can see where your Hermes, your Chanel, your Louis Vuittons are, so it's easy access. And you have the center island for all of your, maybe your watches or your jewelry, so it's easier for you to pick which one to pair with your outfit. Nice, right? And then you have your cabinetry. These are all customized by Vero Casa. And then right here, this is a his and her sink and you have an extra large vanity mirror. So the vanity is also floating and this one is also quartz countertop. And then, come on, let me show you this. Okay, you have your pristine white tub and it goes well with the tiles that they used for the walls. And while you're bathing, let's just pull this one up. And voila, you have a view again of 
the pool and the backyard. As I've mentioned earlier, this house and the interior and everything, they're all thoughtfully made, right? And then again, your towel warmer. And here is your enclosed shower area with his and her shower head. So you could shower together with your partner. If that's your thing, go ahead. And then guys, what's this? So what's missing? Water closet, your throne. So it's enclosed, you have your privacy and it'll keep all the stink right inside. So that's great. And now that we are done with this beautiful walk-in closet, sorry. So let's see where this door is gonna lead us now. Okay, so going to the master bedroom and master walk-in closet, there are three doors or accesses, meaning your parents are not as selfish because they can or you can access it. If you need anything, you don't have to say, Mama, Papa, I need to get something. Nice, right? So now guys, that we are done with the entire tour of the house, you know what's gonna happen next, so come and follow me. Let's go. It's a wrap everyone, now let's do a quick rundown of the property details. So this property sits on a 450 square meter lot area with a total floor area of 800 square meters. It has 6 bedrooms, 6 baths, 4 car carport, a pool, a backyard, 3 kitchens, a gorgeous um, staff room. What else do you need? So again, let us know in the comment section which part of the house is your favorite. Now before I let you go guys, please don't forget to click subscribe to AV Properties official YouTube channel. You can also ring the bell so you get notified whenever we drop our fresh videos here on YouTube. You can also check us out on Facebook and on Instagram. It's at AV Properties underscore official. And if you want to see more of our property listings, you can head on to www.avpropertiescorp.com my name is Apple Grace and thank you so much for staying with us up until this point of the video and guys we want to see you on the next one so bye for now.